a hip hop. What's a hip hop? Hip hop, hip hop, hip hop chant. Let's do it. 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 Hi everyone, I'm Robert Rivera, and this is on the Cheap Tip. Now, before we get started, I'd like to mention one thing that happened this week, and that is that this channel just hit over 10,000 subscribers. What? That's crazy. That was my absolute goal this summer was to get over that 10,000 mark, and it was only because of the love and support that you guys show me that we actually got there. And I am so proud of you guys, and I love you all. And because you give me so much love and support, I'm gonna give you some love and support back and do one of the most requested videos that I've ever gotten on this channel and that is to do a hip hop dance tutorial. That's right. So for those of you who don't know, I work as a hip hop dancer in my everyday life as my full time job and I always get requests for do a dance tutorial, Rob. How about you do a dance tutorial? How about next time you do a dance tutorial, Rob? Maybe a dance tutorial, Rob. Oh, a dance tutorial would be fun. Oh, I think you should do a dance tutorial, dance tutorial, dance tutorial, dance tutorial. I get it. I get it. You want a dance tutorial. Slow your roll. <laughs> Today we're going to learn a move that is actually used a lot by break dancers and it's one of the more traditional dance moves in hip hop called the hip hop kickball change. So let's get started. Alright everyone, now we're here for the tutorial paw and it's going to be pretty simple. So it goes something like this. You're going to start out by kicking one of your legs and we're going to start with our right leg and I'm going to kick it out. It's easy, right? Kick. Just kick it out. When you kick the foot, you're going to cross over your left foot. So it's a kick and a cross. Easy, right? Back again. Kick and a cross. Can't get that wrong, right? Then you're going to step out and toe tap your left foot keeping all the weight on your right foot. Cool? Then you're gonna repeat it on the left side. So you're gonna kick, cross, toe tap, kick, cross, toe tap, kick, cross, toe tap, then get a little faster, cross, toe tap, kick, cross, toe tap, kick, cross. Toe -tap. Now, now for the second part of this, once you get comfortable doing your kick, cross, that. Can't talk. Everyone's watching me in this gym. Hi everyone. I'll see you too. Hi. So what we're gonna do for the next step is we're gonna add in a hop into it because it wouldn't be hip hop without the hop, right? So you're going to kick your right foot again, except this time you're gonna kick and hop. Cool? So you're gonna kick hop. Kick hop. Now you're gonna add in what you did before. So you're gonna kick, kick hop, cross, and step. Toe tap it out. Again, kick hop, cross, tap. Kick hop, cross, tap. Kick hop, cross, tap. Kick hop, cross, tap. Get faster, cross, tap. Kick hop, cross. I'm getting all look at the move. So now once you've got the kick hop step part right, now we're gonna add in some arms. And arms can do whatever you feel they need to do. I like to kind of just throw them out. So I'm going kick hop, kick hop, cross, step, kick hop, cross, step. Kick hop, cross, step, and you can add in boom. Try to make it a little b-boy style. You can do whatever you want. All right, of course, we couldn't hip hop dance without a little music. So we're gonna bring a little music your way. I give you my sweat, blood, and tears. Well, maybe just sweat. And sometimes tears. <laughs> So that was my whole tip, and if you like this video, make sure that you comment down below and let me know because I can make a few videos of this in a series where we do different dance moves and then you can combine them on your own to make your own dance up at home. And make sure that you like this video and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you all next Monday for another great tip. Bye.